Zaniacs. I am Lainey. I am Marshall. Today we're going to talk about uh, The Dilemma by B.A. Paris and I was sent for, for review to read this. I was excited to request it in the first place because I had read Behind Closed Doors and I thought it was a really interesting thriller uh, so I wanted to read something else by them and so The Dilemma takes place in about one day between a husband and a wife telling the story. And it is the story of the woman's 40th birthday party. She's been planning this party. Their daughter lives in Hong Kong. She's going to school for like nine months in Hong Kong. Um, the mom thinks that she cannot come to the party. So she is basically going through the motions of setting the party up, but not having the daughter with them. The dad is also helping set the party up, but dealing with issues with the son because for some reason the son and him are like, they don't get along that well. And he's also planning a surprise that his daughter is coming for the party, but no one knows but him. So it's going to be this big surprise and whatever. And so the dilemma is that they all have secrets that they need to tell each other and they don't. Each chapter is told in like one hour increments back and forth between the husband and the wife. Okay. Okay. Before I go forward, let me let me know what you think about this. It, 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 it's very much about seeing the same things from different perspectives and with knowledges that you didn't have with the other perspective. Yeah, I, I, I think it was maybe intended that way but because of what happens in the book it really was just frustrating to me because you, you see the story from one angle and then another angle but not just that it gets retold and in the wow. second retelling of it you're just kind of like okay we got that like you're talking about exactly the same things in almost exactly the same way with only slight differences and it really does not add to what inherently happens of the, the consequences of keeping the lies all together it, it just it doesn't it doesn't really add to it in fact for this moment I can't even really remember what the wife's lie was because the husband's lie which wasn't even a harmful lie it was just information being kept for good reasons was so much more tragic than the wife's lie and, and I was reading some of the Goodreads reviews and they kind of felt the same way that they just wanted to smack the wife because she was being so selfish about the fact that it was her 40th birthday and she had the party and there was all these things she just didn't want to know or didn't want to deal with because of it. That it just, her reaction to a lot of things just really turned a lot of people off and I can kind of understand that. Mm -hmm. That I just, I don't know that I really liked this book as much as Behind Closed Doors at all. I really, after I read it, was like, mm, okay, I just don't really enjoy this as much as I liked other ones. So I only gave it three stars. So thank you so much for watching. I will have the information down below if it does seem like something that you would be interested in. But until next time. Stay zany. Bye-bye.